Monday morning, guys. How you doing? I uh, got a few yards I need to go mow today. And that countdown's going, guys. Four more days till I get full swing of the season. Me and my wife was going to her brother's house yesterday for Easter. And I stopped. I was like, well, let me stop by this yard real quick and check this out. Now, guys, these people have not called me at all. I'm just like, what the hell is going on? Stopped at this yard right here. Definitely needs to be cut. A little old lady that she was, this lady right here was my very, very, very first customer. Yeah, apparently she's not doing good. So uh, they don't know if they're gonna, they're gonna continue to have it cut or I don't know. She said somebody in the family might, might cut it. She, not her, but her daughter. So yeah, apparently she's in really, really bad shape. And uh, you know, that sucks. Man, look at, look at the field of buttercups out there. This field is so pretty during the springtime. But anyways, let's get over here to the next one. I'm right at this yard here. Let's give you a look at it. Uh, I'm gonna knock it out real quick. I did all the trimming and the edging and all that stuff. Just go ahead and knock this out real quick. Uh, done with this one. You know, the Cub Cadet is really not that bad of a mower. It lays an actual good even cut. Uh, now, you know, that's the second time I've cut with those stripes this way. So, uh, first cut stripe doesn't do that well. But, you know, after you beat it in for a second, you know, two or three times, and then you want to switch it up. But... It actually looks pretty decent. Uh, be a good residential mower it, on just normal yards like this. I wouldn't go into high-end developments and stuff with it just because, you know, fertilized yards and stuff like that. It doesn't, it could be because of the blades. Uh, I'm gonna play around with that after we get into the season a little bit, but really doesn't disperse the grass from non-discharge side. It like the grass doesn't make it all the way to the discharge so it just kind of like rolls a little thing of grass right there so and that could be due to the blades i don't know uh they're nice and sharp uh but you know they're like a mid lift you know they're really not a high high lift uh blade so i don't know i'm gonna play around with it we'll find out and you know we'll just see but there it is guys and uh you know i got the front yard done up here and another thing too with the cup cadet it doesn't mow that high it only mows about right around just a little over three inches and that's on the highest setting so you know also to mow those nice fertilized yards and stuff you want to be mowing around three and a half to four so anyways guys let's get over here to the next yard and be done for the day done with this one quick little 35 dollar yard you guys have seen it before it sucks i only got to, got to do two yards today kind of in the zone i was in the mood to do some mowing but anyways i got to meet up with john i'm gonna go out here and grab the velky take it back out to his house and uh, uh i guess finish building it maybe maybe today i don't know uh might be tomorrow so don't know yet he messed around with it he's got like the part you stand on built so uh, i guess we'll see what it looks like when we get there but uh yeah so that's it i mean that's it of the mowing today I'm gonna show you guys the Velky and stuff and I guess close the video out. So back home here. Didn't uh didn't get any footage up to this point because John had pretty much built it up to this point. So here's the one wheel Velky. Let me pop her back over here. Let you see the bottom of it. So basically, you know, that's just angle irons, all it is. Basically old bed rails. And uh went down through here, drilled the hole. Put the uh, put the wheel in there. Locked everything down real good. Rolls good. All right. Then we'll pop this over on this side. John made a cool little like fender well there. Now I'm sure you guys are asking. Well, hey, what about the front? Well, we're not done yet. Uh, we need to box the front end. I'm gonna come up to about right here, so your feet, the front of your feet, can go into it. That way you don't like you know hit something slot off the front or anything like that then we got to put our trailing arm on and uh this should be good to mount so but i'm going to get some footage of this tomorrow 
of us finishing it up so you guys can see uh but it, lo it looks very strong it seems like it's going to be very strong and hopefully it'll turn out really good so there it is guys i'll see you in the next one Check out my last video, and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. And if you want the full Lawn Mob experience, go over to Facebook and check out my Facebook group.